But, you know, by the last 100 meters, I was excited because I could really just enjoy it, so. <laughs> and do you have something left for tomorrow? I feel, I feel like I just did a hard 400 today, so I don't know if the coaches will be up for it, given that Worlds is so close. Um, in any other scenario, I would be doing the 15 for sure, but now I just have to go talk to, talk to coach and see what they say, so, <laughs> yeah. So is it up in the air about whether you'll run the 15? Well, so the first priority was just to get through today um, and give myself the option. Um, as I was saying, if I had it, if I didn't have Worlds next weekend, there'd be no question that I'd be doing the double and trying to get it again. Um, with Worlds being a week away and with there being rounds, I have to talk to Coach and just see what he thinks is the best plan. Because my number one priority now that I am on the U.S. team is bringing home a medal next week. I'm going to ask you a tough question. How do you feel right this month? Do you want to do it? I would love to do it. I feel like I just did a hard 400, but um, you know, who knows? <laughs> the adrenaline can do crazy things to your body, so we'll see. <laughs> if you made both teams, would you run both events? No, I wouldn't. The um, the double would be a bit more than I think would be <laughs> manageable, at least for someone like myself. So, um, you know, with with four races in three days and being so close together, I don't think it would be. I don't think I would be doing the U.S. team justice Which doing one that. Would you run? Um, the plan has been to do the 3K in this indoor season, so it worked out nicely that the 3K was first at U.S. Champs. Um, I made the team in that, so, um, you know, like I said, I have a guaranteed spot for the U.S. team in the 3K, so now the plan is how do I get a medal next weekend. Does having to the 3K field, does that enter into a decision-making process at all? You know, that's some, definitely something we took into account. There's Zababa and Defar in the 3K, but there's, I think, three Ethiopians in the 15, so um, all who've run close to, like, four minutes, 401. So both races are strong. Um, you know, I, I don't I don't doubt that to come home with a medal, I'm going to have to run a really good round and a really good final. So, um, like I was saying, you know, now the plan, now that I'm on the team, how do I make sure I give myself the best shot at getting on the podium? Compared to this time last year, how do you feel fitness-wise? Um, well, last year at, this, at US Champs, I was coming off of a cold that I had in Birmingham. So, um, fortunately, I'm not sick this time. Um, you know, I was doing a lot of strength work early on and even going to Milrose, I didn't feel, we hadn't really sharpened up that much, but the last couple weeks I've had some good speed work as well as the strength so I feel like I've given myself a lot of tools um, you know now it's just going to be a matter of seeing how they stack up next to the best in the world all right guys we need to take her